Hey, today we're going to be talking about um, a great product at Jerry's Artorama uh, that is called the Paris Oil Primed Linen Canvases. Um, we were discussing uh, and unwrapping this for the presentation that they're so serious about these, they had it packaged twice. Um, they come with these wonderful corner protectors um, that are really on here tightly. Let's take these off so it's a little bit easier to see the linen. All right, now this is a great medium kind of fine tooth linen. Um, just like linen, you've got your little bit of uh, kind of neat texture to it. This is got a layer of glue sizing and then it's got three layers of this luxurious uh, non-yellowing um, oil primer. They sand it down very meticulously by hand in between each layer. Um, it's mounted on these very heavy duty um, pine stretcher strips. You can see um, here, this is from my corner keys. Um, you can see here, instead of your typical tongue and groove um, construction in the corners, they actually used what's called a slat lap joint. Um, that makes for a much tighter, less easy to flex um, type of a corner. It also kind of is gives the ability for this to actually be deeper. So it's much less prone to warping and bending. Um, and will keep a much nicer, you know, tightness. You can't even flex that like you can usually with, uh, with just your kind of old fashioned traditional corners. Um, so you can see the, the linen on the back. It's just a very nice smooth surface. They actually hand pumice these before they even start priming so that any little abnormalities or kind of yarn strands are, are taken right out of it. Um, with the, with the linen itself, it's actually back stapled initially to get that nice and tight, but then they go back in and put in these nice copper tacks. Um, what the copper is going to do is it's not going to rust, it's not going to corrode, um, it's not going to uh, eat at the edges of your, of your linen, um, but they're giving you enough on the back to make it so that you can stretch this again if something happens and you need to um, you know, one of the stretchers somehow breaks in transit or something like that. It just, it gives you that option. Um, but I've used these actually before with some client commissions that wanted oil primed linen. And uh, we used to carry a linen called Charvin. If anybody was like really big on the Charvin linen and is just distraught that those are gone, this is a fantastic alternative. I actually like the priming better on these, which is saying a lot because I was a little bit of a Charvin junkie. Um, I, I like the stretchers, the way they're done much better. Um, the beading on the edge of these is just, is fantastic. You don't get any ghosting, even with that big thickness in the back, which can tend to happen with some stretchers. Um, but it's just a really incredible product. Uh, the oils are going to sit right up on top of it. It's going to make the color very luminous. It's not going to draw down into the primer because of the way they've primed it. So. If you're into oil painting and you're into, you know, really having a nice conservation grade uh, museum quality linen canvas, please try the Paris linen. It is, it is, it's swanky. You'll love it. Thanks.